in the lobby of Ramsey Solutions. Clay and Carolyn are with us. Hey, guys, how are you? Hey, Dave. Great. Welcome, welcome. Where do you guys live? Just outside Atlanta, south well, side. Fun. Welcome to Nashville. Good to have you. And you're here to do your debt-free scream. We, we are. are. I love it. And how much have you paid off? The grand total was about $287,000. Wow. And how long did that take? 66 months. Very good. And your range of income through that time? Ranged from about uh, 60000 at the low end to about 150000 at the high end. Wow. What do you guys do for a living? I'm an educational sales consultant. Mm-hmm. I'm a therapist. Oh, very good. Very good. So 287 over 66 months south side of Atlanta. This must be your house. Yes. You paid off your house. <laughs> you did. I'm looking at weird people. Yeah. I love it. Congratulations, you guys. Thank very you. nice. Thank you. So what's this house worth? Well, we had a house that was worth about 310000 and we paid, paid a good bit of the debt down on that, um, and then we sold that and moved mm-hmm. into a downsized into a, a more appropriately sized house mm-hmm. that's worth about 202000 Okay. So that was part of the journey then, the that move was, down. That was. was. Okay. That was the last step. Very cool. Yeah. And that enabled you to be debt-free. Yes, sir. Completely. Very, yes. very cool. So tell me the story. What happened uh, five years and six months ago that started this journey? <laughs> Go ahead. We had gone through, um, we had been debt free actually in our, in our past together, Mm -hmm. um, but we never really knew kind of what the next steps were. Mm -hmm. Um, And so we kept kind of going back to American Express thinking it was okay because we paid it off all the time. Yeah. Never really expected what it was going to be. Mm -hmm. So we needed to get better control. And we had heard about your program through a pastor at the church that we had been going to. Mm -hmm. And um, when Clay came home and said, I think we should do financial peace. I said, I think that's a great idea. And so we went through that and we paid off. We had $39,000 in consumer debt Mm -hmm. um, that we paid off pretty quickly. Mm-hmm. And then we paid another 70000 about a year after we had started Financial Peace, maybe mm-hmm. six months after we started Financial Peace. Mm-hmm. We paid 70000 and refinanced our house to a 15-year mortgage. Okay. Um, and then worked on that for a couple of years until about a year ago right now when Clay said, I think a big part of what's holding us back and getting further is the house that we were in. It was just very big for us. Mm -hmm. And in five years, our daughter was going to be off to school. Mm -hmm. And we felt like we would never go upstairs again. So, <laughs> there were a lot of rooms that I told we mine, didn't I told mine I was putting a pool table in his, in his room. Yeah, right. that's exactly right. Yeah, fun. So, so then that make, helps you make the decision to move down. Right. So how many square feet were the big house? How many square feet is this one? Right. It went from about 3,000 square feet, 3,000 square feet to about 1,600. Oh, wow. About, about half. About half. Oh, yeah. Okay. Very yep. cool. Very cool. Well, co- neat. Very neat. And perfect. Just in time to be empty nesters, huh? Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> and this close. is your daughter that's with you. This is Sarah. And, and Sarah is how old? 13. 13. Okay. So about five years and she'll be uh, heading off to school, give or take. Huh? That's what we hope. All right. Good deal. Oh, no, it's mandatory. They have to leave. It's, yeah. she, she, you know, it needs to have a plan. Yeah. <laughs> hey, it's good to have you guys. So Thank that's you. very cool. How old are you two? I'm, I'm 46 and 45. Okay. And you have a paid-for house now we that's do. worth approximately what? Just over 200000 Okay. And mm-hmm. part of this was the step down. So I'm trying to kind of put a summation on your story in my head because you guys are you, – you were steady – but, you, you know, you made these moves along the way that were smart moves, and there was no herky-jerky about it. It was like, first we got out of debt, then we refinanced and put 70000 down and got on a fifteen, and then we moved down in-house. And those three moves over a period of five years really just kind of no panic, no jumping around, no craziness, just very steadily making wise, slow decisions – Got you here. That's the way I'm hearing it. Does yeah. that sound right? It was. Yeah, and there was there was something um, that did happen that was pretty uh, significant. This was last uh, January. We'd been talking about it for six months or so about uh, maybe selling the house and maybe downsizing, and we're sort of nervous about all the work that goes into selling a house. And mm-hmm. it was um, it was actually uh, January is my birthday, and mm-hmm. we were we we're having coffee that morning, getting ready to go to church. It was a Sunday morning, and we were saying, you know what? I think maybe maybe we need to do this. And then we went to church, and the, the message that day was about creating financial margin in your life oh my in, goodness. In, in, in order to be a better better steward of God's gifts. And so we were sitting in the, in the service kind of 
Okay, I guess okay, it's God, time, I heard time, you. Time, time to make this happen. Yeah, so. I heard you, God. Yeah, yeah. it's like yeah. he sent a sermon just for you. <laughs> yeah. That's amazing. That's good. Very neat. Um, so, what do you tell people the key to getting out of debt is now that they they know they're talking to somebody who doesn't even have a house payment? That's so weird. <laughs> yeah, I think the big thing for us was just being able to go through a financial piece together and getting focused and really getting on the same page and having the same goals. Um, I, you know, it sounds like that's what everybody says, but that was huge to us. Mm -hmm. Um, May will be our 20th anniversary. And I think the past six years we've been closer than we'd ever been. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I think the budget, I know you talk about all the time, but I just don't see how, how you can really do this without having that, that marks on paper in front of you Mm -hmm. to plan it out. That's, that's to me is, is just where, where it all starts and ends. You're right. It changes the whole equation. It, it does. does. So now, really, when you all started this, Sarah was a little girl. She was. So uh, she's kind of grown up in this weird financial peace house. Um, <laughs> has has it affected her in any any negative way? Is she in counseling or? <laughs> <laughs> we know a good one, just in case. But <laughs> no. <laughs> no. You think she? You think she's getting this stuff? I think so. I, I think she is. Uh, Carolyn tells a story about taking her shopping and to buy some pajamas which sarah had to was responsible for paying for out of the money that she earned from us and Mm -hmm. she was looking at one set of one pair of pajamas that was hello kitty and another pair that was identical but was about half the price and her sort of scratching her head and going well why would i pay twice for the one with the picture of hello kitty on it and just to be clear that wasn't last week (laughs) no 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 that was was, 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 was years ago (laughs) she was a little one then (laughs) yeah i'm I'm thinking okay So we were pretty proud. That was uh, just sort of an example of her sort of getting it, uh, reading between the lines and seeing what we're, what yeah. we're trying really hard to teach her. Good, yeah. good. Yeah, that's it's kind of fun to watch your kids have light bulb moments like that where they it's come awesome. on. Very cool. Well, congratulations, you two. I'm Thank very, you. very proud of you. you. You're heroes, man. You, you took control of your life. You got 20, 25, 30 years here. You're going to become so wealthy and be able to be so generous and have so much margin. Oh, that's pretty neat. Very cool. Outside. Very yeah. cool. So we're going to give you a copy of Chris Hogan's Retire Inspired Book. Book. That's awesome. the next chapter is continue to build wealth and be outrageously generous. Awesome. So Thank he'll you. help you do that with his number one best selling book. Hold on or hold on at the end and we'll make sure we get that for you. But right now it's Clay and Carolyn and Sarah. Two hundred and eighty seven thousand dollars paid off in sixty six months, making sixty to one fifty. They paid off their house and everything, baby. Count it down. Let's hear a debt free scream. Three, Three two, two. One, we're debt free! (laughs) (laughs) Love it, love it, love it. Very well done, you two. You three, very well done. Very well done. That's how it works. So 46 years old and their house is paid off. And they did it in five years and six months. They did move down on house, but they made that decision. The average person that starts this program with Financial Peace University, the book, The Total Money Makeover, listening to this show, gets intense and gets focused and decides they're going to live their life on purpose instead of accidentally, like most people do, is paying off their home in seven years. That's the average. Averages mean that some do it faster and some do it slower, but that's the average. So maybe you're twice as long as the average. So maybe it takes you 14 years. What else you got to do? What else you going to be doing? You know, I read these articles. A guy sent me an article this morning. Some guy wrote, don't pay off your house. It's stupid to pay off your house. Let me just tell you. You, you pay off your house and somebody tells you you're stupid. You're just going to roll your eyes at them and go, you're an idiot. Because when you have a paid for house, you know what you've got. Whew. Financial peace. Two words that don't go together like airline service. This is the Dave Ramsey Show. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, click the subscribe button to get the latest content and check out these other great clips from the show.